The manager of this family-owned business says he believes this massive burglary is part of a large multi-state theft ring targeting Kubota dealerships. Oklahoma and Texas, Arkansas, Louisiana, Missouri. But no matter who did it, Kyle Richardson with Texoma Utility Equipment and Durant police officials agree. The criminals' tactics were impressive. It would have taken so much manpower and been such a big ordeal that it would have had to have been a part of some organized theft ring. The burglary happened sometime between Saturday night and Sunday afternoon when Richardson happened to be driving by and noticed something wasn't right. Sure enough, 12 heavy pieces of equipment were gone, 11 2007 Kubota utility vehicles and one 2007 four-wheel drive tractor. All that was left, a busted gate, three separate footprints in the dirt and several different tire tracks. I never would have thought that it would have happened. I, I would have figured maybe two or three at the most, whatever you could load on a regular size trailer, but 11 of them and a tractor, that would have had to have been a semi, probably two. On top of a bizarre burglary mystery is that no one saw a thing and no one heard any noise coming from the dealership. It's not uncommon. I mean, they're usually in a uh, out part of town. So, and then to see vehicles being loaded, unloaded, late at night is also not unusual. A lot of times deliveries are made during the night. But the thieves were able to drive the machines because keys were in the ignition of several Kubotas still wrapped in plastic. About like all other equipment, one, one key may fit a dozen different models. Just how they were able to load them all up and get away is just what police are trying to figure out. One of the guys that works here with me actually said the only way to stop a human is with another human. Uh, we can't have someone up here 24 hours a day, so we'll just have to we have to manage it the best we can. And while the investigation continues, managers here are considering adding extra security measures. Reporting in Durant, Ryan Lloyd, First News.